Hallo, ich heiße Ryan Wimler und ich bin von Deutschland und ich bin Kicker hier bei Ball State. American football in Europe, it's kind of the same. I played in American high school, but it's a lot smaller. The teams aren't as big, the people aren't as big. You have a lot more people trying out for the soccer teams or everything else besides football. It was last day of PE on my freshman year of high school. The kicker was graduating that year and I've been a soccer player my whole life and the PE teacher asked me to just kick a football during PE class because we had nothing better to do. I just kicked a couple field goals and he like spread the word to all the coaches and they, they kind of like forced me to try out because I was never really interested in football. I looked at playing football in college probably after my sophomore season. People were telling me that I was good at kicking footballs and I should really look into that. And that's kind of when it's shifted from playing soccer, either staying in Germany and playing soccer there or playing soccer in college. Kind of just changed after that season. Being over in Germany, it was hard being recruited for football because no one really plays football big over there. So I had to come to camps here and I just didn't have really many choices, but it all worked out for me. I had went to a camp here, um, got to show the old special teams coach what I could do. It was extremely hard to leave my family back in Germany because Like family means everything to me. I call my mom probably three times every day. I still do just in between classes. And sometimes we don't even have a topic to like talk about. We'll just like be on the phone, like saying a bunch of random stuff. But it was, it was definitely um, a big change for me. Um, I've never lived over here by myself. We just come over here in the summer um, since I was a kid to visit my mom's side of the family. My mom was trying to push for me to get onto a team because uh, like a normal student, I, I'm kind of shy at times, so I don't, she didn't think I would go out and always like, meet different people. But the football team was huge. I mean, they're all a big family to me now. I love every single one of them. My roommate now, and one of my, my best friend here, uh, Mitch Larson, he came up to me during lunch. I had my Bayern Munich jersey on, and then I heard there was some kid from Germany, and You know, he had like this bleach blonde hair. No one was really talking to him, so I felt bad, kind of. I went up to him, I introduced myself, told him my sister lives in Germany, just like to start the conversation a little bit. In my sophomore year of high school, my sister moved to Munich, Germany. She uh, was working at a law firm there. Her husband, my brother-in-law, um, he is full German. So that's how Ryan and I kind of got that contact, and the rest is history from there. I chose Ball State because my mom's best friend that she went to college with here at Ball State, she had a connection with the wife of the old special teams coach, Coach Lustig. With my school getting out so late over in Germany, I missed the special teams camp here. But because of the connection, I got a hold of the coach and he said, I have a like 20 minute lunch break that I could watch you kick a few balls, but that's really all I got and that's all I need to see if you're good enough. I was like, all right, that's better than nothing. So I went out and had a decent day. After he came up to me and talked to me and he said he'll give me a call tonight. Later that night he gave me the call and he said he'd love to have me on the team. It was amazing. My mom and I were so excited. I literally committed like right after. It was just like a dream come true. Ryan Riddler will kick off for the Cardinals. 